Okay, I want to do a prediction video about what I think is going to happen. Um, I don't know, I'm not psychic and I'm, I'm often wrong when it comes to things about the future, but I, I feel like I'm going to go on to Big Brother very soon. I'm going to be just a normal person, probably till Christmas. Okay, I'm going to say till Christmas. Um, this video that I've just watched about the Vinga Boys, about Brazil, kind of makes me realize that actually I, I want to be judged first as a normal person, or at least I want the whole world to have an opportunity to see me on some sort of platform and first of all just choose whether or not they want to watch it you know i feel like maybe i should go in maybe every country i don't know who's like what leaders are do, do the, the leaders of brazil i think that's south of where um america is you know that's that strip you know it's, it's quite a big place actually I, I think that's where it is um I, you know, I, I don't really know where places are. Um, I'm just, um, I've never been there. I know that. But yeah, I, I think the leaders need to say that, you know, Christ, Christ is here. It's, it's God's daughter. Um, you know, watch this show basically. And I, I feel like that's the best way, um, to, um, and the videos just stop working. Hopefully this is recording. I don't know if that recorded. I'm going to stop actually. No, I'm not going to stop. I'll keep playing it. The video just froze, so I don't know if this is still recording. Um, but yeah, I think I need to go on to go on to some worldwide Big Brother for you know the whole world to want to watch it. And, I, and I've got a feeling, you know, if, if it's just not being, if, I, if I'm literally just a normal person, then there'll be no reason for there to be such a a talk about about this show. So I feel like the world probably does need to start saying that Christ is here. This is her. I mean, people can just think that, oh, this is just a shadow elite that's talking and that, you know, whoever these people are, they're just lying. This isn't really Christ. You know, they'll have the option for between Halloween and Christmas Day. I'm hoping that's a timeline, but again, I don't know when you're coming to me, so I don't. Um, but yeah, I think, actually, you know, you're coming to me on Halloween and then I'm gonna be on UK Big Brother just for two weeks where I probably won't say anything. Um, and then that's, and then when it when that stops, or maybe even sort of before it stops, I, I don't really know. Um, but at some point on that show, I'm going to be taken onto another show, which is going to be the, the sort of world platform where I go in as a normal person um and and start you know that people around the world will say that you know christ is here this is the daughter of god um and that they will have the option to watch this show whether whether to, to you know to decide whether or not to watch it and then on christmas day um i think i need to come forth and tell people that i think that i'm god that i think people have known about me for 10 years um there might be a lot of lies going around me i, I don't really know um, you know, I, I can tell people the power of my name and just basic things that I know. Um, and people will then have a vote to decide whether or not they think that they are my people or whether they think that, you know, if, would they want to just loads of loads of opinions. I, I think the viability test is important. Um, there's my sister's son who I would have liked to look after. Um, and I, it's, it's painful that it's not, he's not with me, but at the same time, I feel like there's a reason for that and that is to test the world on whether or not they think I'm capable of looking after after a baby and and to give their thoughts on me and um, maybe the thoughts can be also there can be a second one which is about whether or not they believe that I'm God you know people might just be like oh this person isn't Christ she's they're just you know the elites are just saying that she is um, because they're trying to set up a false messiah and they, they're using this girl who's who's clearly stupid and an and idiot or whatever um, you know wh whatever they want to think is whatever they will think and I, I think there should be something on paper so that they can be reminded of their thoughts in, in a year's time or whatever um, and and then um, I guess there'll be a hundred days where I'll be in some sort of sacrifice. But I think when it comes to the normal TV, such as just ITV or channel or all the channels, or not not just thinking of England, but all the channels, you know, you'd have the option to find out more about me. But I probably won't know if I I don't know how much. It would be up to you what I say or, or what goes on viral. As, as long as I'm not actually suffering. Um, but yeah, if you want to tell people that I'm just shining some sort of light in some tiny bedroom somewhere, I mean, that technically is kind of truth. It is truth because that, that's what happened in 2013. I knew that I was God. I was I was going online. I was seeing make me connect with things everywhere and people around asking things in my head, talking in my head and then having people walk past and feel like they're answering the question. 
and then trying to listen to what their actual conversation is about and it turned out to be nothing about it so it was just like well why did you just say that particular sentence you know that happened a few times just weird stuff like that was happening all the time and and yeah I couldn't talk to people and I didn't know why people were doing things and and it just it just felt like a complete nightmare um but yeah that was the situation where I was in a tiny room whilst looking at celebrities who are rich and, and earning lots of money and, and, you know, doing huge amounts of photo shoots and videos and, you know, and then to have to go 10 years of that, that's just so, so it's awful. It's awful. But I feel like the same thing needs to be repeated. Things go around in cycles. What comes around comes around. That song came into my head. And, um, but yeah, um, that scene kind of needs to be replayed only the world needs to know and the world needs to think that I'm now just in some sort of bedroom shining some sort of light where the world just has to ignore me and then the normal TV and the normal channels can just carry on like like nothing's really changed although with one difference which is that the singers and celebrities are now um, going to be in the focus so you'll just carry on as normal but you can maybe use the angels that I've named um but I don't know at what point at what point that you start revealing that they have names um I mean you could say until maybe maybe my birthday that would be might be an, an idea to to reveal the names so there'd be a hundred days between Christmas day and um because hundred does seem there seems, seems to be something about that hundred days so in those hundred days I can look like I'm suffering the celebrities um can look like they all just represent me and then on my birthday, on April 3rd, um, you say that actually they've all got angel names or something. Maybe that should be the plan. Um, and then then there could be, I don't know what could happen. They maybe I still suffer after that and then, or maybe it look like I'm still suffering or whatever. I don't, I, I don't care as long as I'm in a nice house. I don't, I don't really, I don't. I don't want anything else you know I, I want a jacuzzi a nice house and lots of takeaway meals and to maybe go places and to actually see things I would have said I would love to be on on tv and stuff but I just I I want to do things but I don't really want the public to know about me and and so if I if I am doing things it can be just from a green screen or whatever um and saved for two or three years in the in the future or, or whenever I, I don't know I, I want to do stuff but I, I I will have a massive problem working with people after this you know I I, I will be thinking were, were you the, just the people that were just torturing me for 10 years you know um tr trying to work with people who who have just hurt you a lot you know that's going to be hard and there will always be a part of me that doesn't know the truth about who was responsible for it and stuff so yeah, I don't know. And even if I am working with people who are not responsible, I, I might feel like they are being paid by people who are responsible for it. And so I'm I'm going to definitely struggle to, to live from, from now on. Um, if I did have a, a life that doesn't involve just sitting in a room doing nothing all day. Um, but yeah, I, I am trying to think about the positives, which is that my higher self got to do stuff. But then at the back of my mind, I'm like, is my higher self doing stuff or is this all just the spirit that's doing all this work and I'm just doing nothing but being part of the matrix I I'm pretty sure my higher self is doing stuff but it is just me that's telling me this and I don't necessarily trust me so there we go um but anyway.